Okay, we're back talking again about delivery elements. Okay, in the last video, I talked about the elements that you're going to deliver to a sales agent or distributor when you're selling the movie. And then if you think about these things up front, you're in much better position. You know, a lot of times a sales agent or distributor will ask you, uh, when is the film ready to deliver, right? You usually sign the contract and then you have a certain amount of time, 30 days, just let's just say, to be able to deliver those elements, okay? And in the last video, we went over the, the, the elements as far as the video goes, uh, the trailer, potentially, unless they're gonna cut it for you, the artwork, potentially, but stills. No matter what, if you're doing the artwork or they're doing the artwork, you need to have stills, okay? Today, what we're gonna talk about is the other elements. One of the things that is extremely important that filmmakers miss a lot is the M and E track. Now, what is this? This is, the music and the effects on a different track from the dialogue, okay? They could be separate tracks, one music track, one effects track, or one music and effects track, but the dialogue has to be different. Can you think of why? Well, if you're going to put this film in another language and dub it, and not just subtitle it, dub it, okay? Well, how could they do that if everything's mixed together on one channel? They would have to pull it out. And there, there is actual people that, sound engineers, that have done that where they actually took, tried to pick the dialogue out and that's expensive and a painful process. If you're, you have them on separate channels to begin with and the dialogue's clean, well, then that's it, much, much easier to dub it. And there's countries like Germany, like Spain, that really aren't as much into subtitles and they want dubs to be able to sell there. So I will just say this. If you have an m and &E track, you are gonna sell much more internationally. Films have come to us where they go, oh no, we don't have M&E. I go, well, okay, you've just limited certain places will not acquire your movie, okay? So that's something that you need to, to get going forward. Another thing is captions, okay? Captions can be done very simply on Rev.com. Rev.com is pretty much the accepted industry standard for captions. They're $1.25 a minute. So think about that. You got a you know 100 minute movie, 90 minute movie, you're paying relatively around $100 to get your captions done. And they're gonna be in SRT format or SCC format. One is subtitles, one is captions. But the good news is Rev even has a conversion tool on the site to convert between those. So that's fantastic to note. But you select captions, you get them from Rev.com. The other thing that you may need is a dialogue list. A lot of times if there's going to be full translations and they're going to translate the, the dialogue instead of the actual captions itself, uh, they may need the dialogue list, which also could be done on Rev.com. And I'm not talking about the script, which could be something else you may need to deliver. That's something you should always have too. But the dialogue list will literally break down all the dialogue. And I know that for when I'm delivering films to Korea, Taiwan, Vietnam, China, they have asked for the dialogue list as well. Okay, I hope that gives you a general overview of the things that you need to be thinking of. There are other aspects of it. Uh, the e and insurance is something. That's something that could be a potential cost down the road. E&O insurance, three to five grand to get the insurance. It's errors and emissions insurance. Um, some distributors will provide it for you, some won't. Some might be able to add you to their policies, but some require it, where they come in and they say, well, we need E&O for you to sign this deal, and then bang, there's another three to five grand. So if you thought about that ahead and you factored, the, factored that into the budget, then you're in much better shape. Again. I will say this, distributors and sales agents love when you have a film that's very simple to deliver. They will be your friend. They will be excited about that movie. If you want more videos about filmmaking, check out the link below. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking subscribe.